Well lads, what's the crack? My name is RJ Runner and welcome to Stigmatized Property, a indie horror game which you can get now on Steam. It's going for as little as €2.39 or you can pick it up as part of a bundle which is what I did. Uh, bundle, it's bundled along with uh, I think it's f four other games. Now I haven't gotten a chance to play through these other games yet. I saw a video from one of them and boy god it looked absolutely fucking terrifying. So um... I may or may not do a let's play of that on my channel, I have yet to decide, uh, depending on my work schedule and whatnot, and how I'm feeling that particular day, because as you know, I'm pretty lazy with this, because it's just a bit of a hobby. Anyway, I'm already kind of spooked out, there's a, what seems to be a, a little old lady or a child poking their head out there on the left hand side of the screen, and someone standing very ominously still at the end of the street. Alright, let's get into it. Let's see if this game can make me shift myself. Start, please. Yeah, there we go. Is it starting? Did I break it already? Okay, no, good. And, um, as you can tell from the get-go, it's sort of in the VHS style. I mean, it's kind of cool. It. I don't know why you'd put it in this style, unless, of course, the person that you're playing as is actually recording their, um, Little adventure here, but uh, other than that, I know it's a, a bit redundant. He suddenly invited me to his house. I wonder why. Wow, wow, is all I'm gonna say. Uh, so we had to go to a house or an apartment somewhere. Am I reading that right? Not. I'm gonna forge my own path. Screw this. I'm done being told by developers which way I should be going. I'm just over it. I'm done. I want to forge my own path. If I want to go left, I'll go left. If I want to go right, I will damn well go right. Can I go right? Oh, uh, yes? No? Maybe so? Of course I can. Am I getting lost? Will I end up getting lost? I probably will. Where the hell did I come from? What the hell is... What is this? Pray in front of the shrine. You know what? Yep. Yeah. Oh, of course I will. Praise the Lord or whatever the hell I am praying to. And pray. Pray that evil away. Mm, yeah, that feels so good. Man, I feel so holy. I hope this is the right way. Oh, oh no. It's a little kitty. And he's dead, poor thing. Oh, I don't like seeing dead, dead, dead animals or dead cats or dogs. I really like cats, and I know I li like dogs too. I have two cats of my own. Uh, I I'm explorer. I'm exploring. I'm gonna do some exploring here. Oh, what's this? Ten yen. Awesome. I can buy a penny, penny bar with this. Can I use it on this machine? No. Right. Fine. Whatever. Don't want your dumb candy bars anyway. Uh, right. Uh, 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 everything's dark here. Why is everything so feckin' dark? Can I go down this uh, anyway? Okay. Let me through. Let me through. I want to explore. Damn it. Let me explore. Out of my way. I know I can go down this way. It's a way I can go down. Don't deny me this. Do oh, here we go. Anything scary around here? Oh, no. Another shrine. Cool. Yes, pay, pray in front of the shrine. Awesome stuff. Okay, so that's two shrines. Is does praying at the shrine somehow affect the outcome of this game? Because I've read in, I've read a bit about this game. I know that there's at least two endings. Oh, a fish or a poisson if you're French. So that's where the smell was coming from. Oh. Me, I'm not really a fish guy. I don't like fish. I hate fish. Right, he told you to be in apartment room 104. Is that upstairs, downstairs? Probably is. Probably, I mean, probably is upstairs, but I'll just search all of these. Ooh, a frog plant. Ghetto, ghetto. Ghetto, 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 ghetto. Gotta, gotta, get a better, get a gospel! Where do I go? It's lock it. No, always lock your cars at night, because, uh, you know, somebody will break into. Oh, another shrine! Yes, pray. 
Praise the Lord, save my evil, wicked soul for the foul deeds of which I'm about to commit. Um. Uh, hit. Is this room 104? No. Back of it? Perhaps? Maybe? Yeah, no. Okay, those reflections are odd. Whatever, I'm not gonna question them. Okay, up the stairs we go. Guess this room 104? No? This must be it. Because I assume they're highlightable or clickable. So maybe this one. I heard a click? No? It's gotta be downstairs. Oh wait, maybe it's this one. Do I, do I break and enter? Okay, cool. You try that. I mean, damn it! No, no. Oh, there lies the problem. I don't have any legs. I don't have any legs. Uh, maybe I should try the door again. Maybe. Wait, what? Knock on the door. Oh, yeah, I suppose I have, you know, uh, manners and whatnot. I mean, you just don't crawl through someone's bedroom window. Unless you're a pervert! Ahoy, ahoy! Sumimasen. Hello? There really is no one. I can't just wait outside. I need to get in. Okay, looks like we are breaking into this house then. Oh, it's gotta be under one of these plants. That is the stereotypical way you hide a spirit key. It's under a plant. It's gotta be under one of these, no? No? Clicky, clacky, click, click. No? No? Okay, never mind. Oh, it's under a lemon tree pot. It's this the lemon tree pot. These don't look like lemons to me. I mean, I'm no botanist, but these definitely don't look like lemons. They... I can't tell what they look like, but lemons, they do not. Oh. Alright, got the key. Sweet. In we go. Semi masse! Arigato! Wow, this room looks really good. For an apartment? Jeez, keep that cynicism somewhere else. Just because you don't have a nice room like this. Actually, whoa, whoa, this is actually pretty nice for an apartment. Oh my god, he's got donuts! Why would he be on a couch? No, 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 no. Keep, keep those on a table. No, don't, don't, don't put a plate on a couch. That looks messy. Uh, man, yeah, but it looks nice, looks, looks nice. This is what I aspire to own myself one day. And it is a nice 40 degrees inside. Nice and warm, so can I... What do we do? Oh, a book. Excuse the hell out of me. Wait, 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 wait. Shh, wait. Did I just hear a door close or lock or lock or something? Hello? Okay, some shit is about to go down. Looks like I'm gonna have to bash and skills in. Alright, who's there? Who opened what? Who locked what? Okay, that the front door's still open, so um door number one. Okay. Door number two. Mm. Okay, I'm alive. Did I manage to knock someone out? No, 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 there's no danger. Jesus Christ, game, don't be spooking me like that. My heart, I mean... I mean, I just can't take the scares. Excuse the hell out of me. I'm no reflection of God damn it, I'm a ghost. I'm the one who's dead. That door is locked in the reflection as well. Uh, right, uh, okay, uh, maybe, maybe I'm in Mirrorland. Maybe... Maybe this, maybe, 
maybe what the mirror is reflecting is the real world and I'm in a mirror world or something like that. I don't know. I don't know these crazy things. Okay, whatever. Uh... Okay. What's coming in the bath? Something else to pick up? I, I can't pick it up. I, I can't. I can't. I have to get rid of this hook or pipe, whatever it is. Uh, can I? There's nothing to get fucking drop it. Why am I walking around with this like an asshole? Uh, right. Maybe this diary will tell me something, or this book. No. Okay. Okay. Fine. I have to get the pages. Ah, uh, I see. But where would the page be? Oh, what? Use hook. Yes, I will. Would it be a page in here? Okay, I do have a page. Right, so do I put it in here? April 4th. Moving is over at last, and today marks the first day living alone, and also the first day writing a journal. I really look forward to the experience. I've always dreamed of it. I decided to move here because the rent is very cheap. I honestly can't believe that a broke student like me can afford such a nice room. Plus, it's really close to my school. How amazing is that? I ate out with my parents today to celebrate the move, and they were both laughing and just having a great time. Living alone is great and all, but man, I'm going to miss those faces. They told me that they're going to be here for only a couple of days. They kept telling me how worried they are, but they're just overthinking. They don't have to worry about a thing. I'm going to do just fine. Finish reading, I will do indeed. Ah, uh, okay. So, um... Uh, 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 ooh, uh, e. Am I the person who owns this house? No, I can't be. Who am I? Who the hell am I playing as? Am I a friend or something? I must, I must be a friend and I'm just investigating this. Uh, can I, oh, I can look through the hole again. I can look through the hole. Anything interesting? Huh. No. Not a thing. Not a damn thing right am i done here am i done in this apartment yeah i am and i'm get oh there's another thing in here uh the paper's wet i need to find a way to dry it aha i saw a dryer out here before apparently that's gonna do it because um a piece of paper that was absolutely saturated in bath water is going to be just fine with, with drying it with a dryer. So, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll dry it, we'll dry it. Wait, I said yet. Yeah. Will you let me dry the damn thing. Now, I doubt anything written on this will be legible, to be honest, but we'll give it a go, we'll see. April 5th. Today I took the whole day just setting everything up in the room. What used to be a room with small luggage and a simple bed now became a room with a bunch of furniture and a whopping queen sized bed. The previous tenant left everything and the owner was too lazy to get rid of them. Dad seemed to like the cell so badly. He said he'd like to stay a little longer. But as much as I appreciate their company, I'd like to live life already. The owner came to say hello today. He looked like he could use a little sleep though. He shook my hand with a big smile on his face told me how grateful he was for someone to finally rent the room, but how he stopped smiling right away when he let my hand go. That was way too weird. Anyways, the new semester starts tomorrow. Gotta get ready. Yes, I'm finished reading. Okay, so there's a little more to this than meets the eye. A lot of it is given away in the title. This is a stigmatized property, and as far as I know, a stigmatized property is a property in Japan where someone has uh, died and they normally go for cheap. That is an actual thing in Japan that is a uh, part of Japanese culture for some reason. I mean, I don't really believe in ghosts, to be honest. I mean, I mean I'm a bit of a skeptic, to be honest, but yeah, you know, I'm kind of half and half. I, I half believe, half don't believe, if that makes any sense. You gonna give me that, or do I have to punch you in the face? What the? No. Oh, I. There's a 
fish I can give him. And maybe the cat too? Okay, so there's the fish. And there's the cat, unless the cat is for something else, I don't know. Well, whatever, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take the fish because I don't feel like giving him the cat. I don't think he'd be able to fly away with the cat or take the cat or eat the cat. Well, he'd be able to peck at the cat, but um, I'd much ra rather give him the fish. Is that door open? Yeah, someone's peering out. Hey, how you doing, neighbor? Don't mind me, I'm just uh, gonna take this fish from the garbage, wash it, and uh, maybe eat it for myself. You gonna say something? No? You wanna share this fish with me? You wanna come up to my... Well, it's not my apartment, it's my friend's apartment. You wanna come up there, share this fish? Go have these? Go on! Just trying to be friendly. Alrighty then! You, you drop... Uh, sir? Sir? You dropped something. Oh, uh, um, maybe I have to pick it up and. Sir, oh, it was ten yen. Sir, you dropped ten yen outside for some reason. Sir, sir, take your ten yen back. Sir, I'm just a weirdo with a fish who wants to give you your money back. Well, fine, whatever. More money for me then. Uh, can I buy something in the vending machines? Oh yes, I can. Yes, what's in here? Hmm. That's odd. I see a crumbled paper in one of the slots. It says it costs a hundred. Oh, ha 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 ha! I see. I need a hundred yen to get the last diary page. Probably. What's this? Is it more money or is it something else? Oh my God! It was fifty yen. So we have seventy yen now. Okay, sweet, 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 a Rooney. We are going to get to the bottom of this. Hey, hey! I got that fish you were looking for. You want a fish? You speedy Gonzales motherfucker! Took off faster than a hooker on speed, he did! Boy! April 6th. Today was the first day of the semester. It's good to see my boys again. They wanted to come to see my new apartment, but I don't know. They better not fuck anything up. Mashima Sensei is my homeroom teacher. I wonder what kind of teacher she is. I hope she's not mean like the previous one. That guy was an asshole. Another weird thing happened today. When I got out of the room this morning, some middle-aged ladies across the street gathered and talked bad about this apartment. Women of that age like to gossip a lot. It's probably whatever. Yeah, it's probably whatever. Whatever whatever is, it's just whatever. Whatever, Trevor. That hole is still there, good. Okay, can I go in here now? No? I'm guessing there's going to be another paper up to get in there, but I have to find some way to get to it. I can't climb in here. You could have got no legs! That, and I'm probably just on the short side anyway. So I need, I need, I need, I need to find a ladder or something. Or a box. Just gonna do some more pouring. Can I walk down this way? Of course I can. Why can't I? Oh, 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 what's this? It's a key! Oh my god, do we get to drive this car? Please tell me we, we get to drive this car. I've always wanted to drive a Mini. Is that what it is? It looks like a Mini. Yes, a Mini Cooper. Well, it's his mother's uh, car. Oh, 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 I, oh, I see. I see. I must be this guy's girlfriend. Ah, uh, yes. Very perceptive. Vroom, vroom. Can I get in? I want to get into his mom's car. Oh, no, there's a piece of paper here. Okay, fine. We are one step closer to solving this mystery. Whoa! Whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa, who put that there? Was that always there? No, no, that, that mirror was over there. Something funny is going on, and that chair mysteriously hopped up on the table. Have these inanimate objects somehow gained senti sentience? Is this like Beauty and the Beast? Okay, I'm keeping an eye on you. Don't start talking while I'm turned around. April 7th. I said hello to my fellow neighbors today. That's a polite thing to do, right? Always be nice to your neighbors, right, Mom? But you know what, Mom? I don't think that works here. Because I just got the cold shoulders from them. 
When I said good morning to the neighbour on the right, he just stared at me with his big eyes and without a word from his mouth. He shut the door on me. Even now, his big cat-like eyes won't leave my head. Uh, I shouldn't be too rude. I'll probably give it another go some other time. Anyway, today I saw a girl who looked just like the girl in Shikibara 89 in my class. Her name's Mira, and I'd like to get to know her. And from what I heard, she's single and ready to mingle. How lucky am I? I'm excited for tomorrow. Oh, <laughs> you devil. You devil. Oh, I know what's going on, so I must be Mira. Am I Mira? Yeah, that's gotta be it. I'm Mira. Okay, fine. We're playing from the perspective of Mira. Right, we've got that nailed down. So everything's falling into place nicely. Um, what I want to do is I want to do some more exploring first. I'm pretty sure I haven't really explored the back alleys. Maybe I, I can explore the back alleys and find um, more things. And the dead cat's gone. Excuse me. What is that? Is that something I have to investigate? Is this something I need to investigate? I mean, I'm not... Sibi my son! I will not go down that way today, no. I will not be dealing with the dark spirits of the underworld yet. No, 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 no. What is this area? God damn dark to make out a damn thing. Where am I? Oh, another shrine. Pray in front of the shrine. Yes, pray the evil away. Spirits be good. I feel slightly warmer. Is it just my imagination? Okay, please tell me this will keep any and all evil spirits at bay. Oh, no, they're still there. Oh, I do want to go. I don't want to go. Uh, I'm just a boy. Is that an umbrella? Is that you, the Virgin Mary? Is that you? Oh, Holy Mary, what of God! Hey, Virginers! Now the other dead. Amen. Okay. That was unnerving. Not really too scary, just a little unnerving. I was expecting a little more, but you get what you get. And I and I got um, I got another ten yen, so I need another twenty yen. Not sure where I'm going to get that last twenty yen though. Um, I guess I can explore back here a little more. Maybe there's more things that have unlocked. I know that there's a little. Ah, the life was off here before. Um, Simi Masen. Oh, hi, oh, hi, oh, Knock on window. Knocky, knock, knock. Oh, hi, oh, must Why is he just standing there? I have no idea. Sir, are you, are, are you all right? Is everything okay with you? Are you just admiring the uh, weird wallpaper on your wall here? I mean, it's a bit out of place. I mean, I mean, I like art and all, but that's a little too abstract for me. Can I come in? Excuse me. Okay, he's not there anymore. Okay, you just watch this now. I'm gonna grab a key object from in here and he'll just fucking show up in my face and go <laughs> Oh Oh hi oh hi oh hi Okay there's the newspaper and the diary entry and is there anything else? Oh it's that letter I need that Apartment memo This apartment cannot be demolished I tried to call a contractor trying to destroy it But for some reason the phone line stops working My mother suddenly becomes ill I hope it isn't related Eh, probably not, I mean... I mean, shit happens, this is just life. The local priest will not come. I tried to ask other people to ask the priest. The priest got into an accident and died. No, I don't finish reading, I'm not finished reading yet. Um, 
Okay, uh, again, not really related. I mean, accidents do happen. Talismans are useless. I bought a box of talismans and sucked them on my walls, but they were burned the next day. Whenever I put a talisman on a wall, the word curse will continue to appear in my head. Ah, I see what's going on now. Our apartment is the stigmatized property, so someone died in it, or the apartment itself was cursed from the get-go. The apartment building does not catch fire. The building repels fire. Good! Good! That is good! It is fireproof! Okay, great! I mean, that is something to be proud of. I mean, everyone needs a fireproof home. I mean, if my house or the house I'm living in could repel a fire, that would be great. I mean, I, I could start a little fire outside, outside my window, keep myself warm, just go, hmm, stick my hands out, out there, knowing that it will not penetrate the walls. That'd be, you know, that'd be awesome, okay? What, what, whatever, it's fireproof. It's up to standards, okay? You meet the RGJ runner standards of um, apartment well-being. Anywho, enough of that. The apartment must continue to sell. A resident will be chosen every month. The chosen one will be possessed in a week. And after the possession, the person completely disappears from this world, and no one remembers a thing about the person. I keep having nightmares, and a strange voice keeps telling me to bring human. Ningen. I can't sell the apartment. I can't let them hurt my family. Someone, please, help me. Now I am finished reading. Okay. So the apartment is cursed and lover boy has probably disappeared. We'll learn more about that after reading this and I will come and collect this afterwards. Because you can only hold one thing at a time and unlike most games I don't have an inventory screen which means I cannot jump things up my arse for uh, storage. April 8th. Mom came over to my room again. Ugh. I told her she doesn't have to anymore. I think she had a fight with dad again. Her passive-aggressive attitude got to me, so I asked her how Dad is doing. She refused to talk about it, and instead just sat there quietly. I've never seen her act like this before. She would usually put a fake smile on her face after a fight. I would notice that, but it just wasn't like that this time. An hour or so later, she regained her usual positivity when she asked me if I can invite my old time friend Sayaka. She had the biggest smile when I agreed to it. Mom must be worried for me to live alone still. I only have Mirachan in mind right now, though. Hmm. But that smile. Her eyes weren't smiling. Finished reading. Okay, so, um. Mommy and Daddy had a little spat. Okay, fine. Whatever. So, what do you have for me? What waits on the other side? Look through the hole? Eh, might as well. It's not gonna kill me, is it? Okay, this wall is now red. And I think that door is open now? I think that was closed before and um, I can hear some strange chanting. Huh. Okay, whatever. That wasn't too scary. Now when I turn around, something scary is going to be behind me. Am I right? Dun, 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 dun. Ah! Okay, no. Good. Uh, what's this? Ooh, I got 90 yen now. Okay, sweet. Sweet Irene, I just need another 10 yen to get the last page. Where am I going to find... Oh, right, I know where I'm going to find that last yen. It's probably going to be in the bomb room, is it? Excuse me. The bloody... Oh, hi, neighbor. Uh, you gonna give me the last 10 yen I, I need? You know what? Uh, um, I'll give you a rain check, okay? Okay, right. I know that's there at least. Wait, there's gotta be something in here I need. Climb through the window? Yes, even though I don't really need to. Okay, I don't see anything. Oh, a diary page. Yes. But first, you know what? I've been holding a big one in, so I just gotta, um, uh, you know. Okay, just gotta position myself just right. 
and <clears throat> I feel real good after that. Uh, right, just gotta wash my hands. Um, yeah, okay, so much for sanitary. Okay, let me out. Let me put this paper in the diary and see what it's all about. April 9th. I was able to talk to Mirachan today. What a great day. Or, sorry, um. What a great day. I forgot the, um, full stops. Except for one thing. Mom was gone when I woke up this morning. Her car was still parked here, and it's odd for her to leave without notice. I hope Dad picked her up or something because the car is still there. I invited Sayaka today, and she said she'd come tomorrow. I hope this makes her happy again. Finish reading? Yes, I will do indeed. Okay, wait, 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 whoa. I'm, I'm confuzzled. What was that? Can I, can I read over that? Is there a way I can read over that? Am I Sayaka? Is that me? I'm confused. This game is doing me a confusion. Uh, okay, um, right. Let's, let's go see your neighbor. Send me my sand. Uh, you got something for me, buddy? If the bass was turned up any louder on my headphones, that might have been scary. Okay, right, gonna take that. Oh, I have 100 yen now. Can I explore this apartment now? Can I go out through the store? Can I do anything else in this apartment? No, no. Is this even an apartment? It doesn't look like an apartment. It looks very plain. It looks very boring. Okay, yeah, got the paper. There is no escape. I can't read the rest. Yet, you were able to decipher what was written on a soaked piece of paper that had been dunked in a bath. Yet, you can't read whatever on this piece of paper right here. M might be squiggles, who knows? I'm I'm not going to get too in-depth in depth with this. Finish reading. Yes, I will do indeed. I'll call him later. I need to get home. Okay, good idea. It's way too spooky in this place. And to go. Really? That easy? You let me leave? So so soon? Okay, fine. Whatever. I'm getting out of here. I looked back repeatedly as I felt I was constantly being watched. But no matter how many times I looked, no one was there. I couldn't handle the fear. I walked as fast as I could. He was absent from school the next day. His seat was occupied by someone else. I tried asking his friends and teachers, but none of them knew or even heard of his name. After school, I went to the same apartment. However, the apartment was sold. According to the locals, the place had been sale has been on sale for a while. Where did the apartment go? And the boy I knew and loved. Where did he go? Oh, I missed the end, God damn it! I don't remember his name either. Wait, who am I even talking about? The end. Result saved. Oh, I see! I got the good ending? Is that considered a good ending? I mean, um, I suppose the other ending would be where I'm would have been possibly possessed or cursed I don't know um I I'm not sure how to get the second ending maybe it's got something to do with giving give, giving the cat to the crow or not praying at the shrines maybe I'm not sure I'll give it a go I'll give it a go see if we can get the second ending all right I got the last page again now I didn't pray at the shrines but what I did do was um I gave the crow the fish again uh, because I, I didn't really feel like giving him the cat, to be honest. Um, it just felt very wrong. Now, maybe that might affect the outcome. I'm not sure. Unless, unless there's more than uh, two endings. I think there's only two endings. So um, I'm pretty sure it's only the shrine that affects the outcome. It's the only thing that makes sense. Okay, there is an escape. I'll come later. I need to get on. Oh, that door is locked now, or it's closed, one or the other. 
Does that mean I can escape through here, or do I have to try and open it first? Okay, uh, look through. I suppose I will. Well, that's freaky. Jesus, mother of God! <laughs> At the end, result possessed. Christ, that actually fucking got me. <laughs> oh my god. I, I sort of braced myself for that. I knew the second she started turning, something like that was gonna happen. My <laughs> fucking hurt, though. Oh, okay, fine. Yeah, um, for um, a little indie horror game made by two people, I believe, only two. They've made about, I think it's either another four or five games. It's pretty damn good. And like I said, I saw a video for one of their other games on Steam. Uh, it was um, a preview of the game. It wasn't like a, a let's play of it. It was um, the video preview in the Steam store itself. And it looked kind of terrifying, to be honest. It's sort of like um, based on old PS1 games. It sort of got that Sun Hill vibe. But enough about that one. Going back to stigmatized property. Yeah, I think it was kind of well done. I think... Um, the VHS stylization uh, wasn't necessary. I mean, I I don't I don't I don't know. It's not not my style. I mean, it's o it's okay I guess um, when done correctly. And I, and I suppose um, it was done right, but um, it didn't make sense at the same time. But yeah, it was um it was done quite well. And uh, one thing that also caught my eye or my ears at least was um, the atmosphere, the atmospheric sound effects. You can hear motorbikes, you can probably hear them right now. You could also hear footsteps, so it, I suppose it kind of took the scariness away, but it sort of uh, presented a sort of um, realism to the game as well, because you're going to an apartment, you're in a populated area, so it makes sense for to be, for to, blah, 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 blah. it makes sense for there to be um, people walking about, even if you can't see them. And not a lot of indie horror games, or not a lot of horror games even, I have that. They just have this sense of um, isolation, the sense of fear, lo loneliness, um, the, a sense of uh, I, I can't think of the word vulnerability. So, um, but that game didn't really, or sorry, this game didn't really have it. But it was still done pretty well, even without the typical, um, uh, typical uh, sort of building blocks of other horror games. So yeah, uh, well done, it was money well spent on my part, I would insist that if you do enjoy horror games or indie horror games, you go to the Steam store right now, pick it up, it's only about 2 euro or 12 or 13 euro for a bundle of um, 4 or 5 indie horror games. And to be honest, if this is anything to go by, I can't wait to play the rest. I might put them up as Let's Plays on my channel, or I might just play them in my own spare time whenever I get off work again, which won't be till uh, Thursday, whenever Thursday will be, whenever uh, this video goes up. Hopefully, um, at the time of recording, maybe, because like, I don't have a lot of time on my hands to record a video a day or even two videos a day I'll try and go for two videos a day at some point maybe if I upgrade my GPU because um, it, it takes about nearly an hour and a half like I said to record anything in 1080p depending on the length or sorry not not even 1080p at uh, 1080p 60 FPS I mean I could probably grind out a few videos if I just did them in standard 1080p 30 FPS but I know what the way um, YouTube is it's they're going more for quality so if I can pump out one or two good videos in 1080p 60 FPS I will be satisfied I, I will be proud of myself for doing that because I do want to maintain quality I do want to put out that good quality content even though like I'm not really getting anything back from this it's just a little hobby for me I like doing it I like um, if I get comments, I like interacting with, with people. I want their thoughts, their, their um, perspectives on certain game styles. So yeah, I'm just trying to build up a little bit of a community here. So anyway, guys, I'll stop rambling on. If you did enjoy this video, you know what to do. Give it a thumbs up, comment, favorite, share it with your friends, and of course, subscribe if you want to. And I will see you guys in the next one. So on to next time. See ya.